start by deleting your WTF folder and interface folder. Drag the uh, items you just downloaded to the WoW folder. Go into the WTF folder, then into account, and on the first folder type your account name in caps. On the second folder type your realm name, and on the third folder type your character name. Now log into WoW. Let's start off with a chat add-on. Right click on the chat tab and go to settings. Then go to profile and change it to pixel point UI. Now type slash bar to open the bartender menu. Go to profile and change it to pixel point UI. Now type slash BF, change the profile. And we also need to change some individual settings. Change them to DSM fade. It is important to change also the action bar 1. And also change the stand settings to pixel shadow. Open omen config. Type omen toggle to show omen if it doesn't show. Go to profile and change it to pixel point UI. Click on show test bars to see if it's working. If it doesn't, type omen toggle twice. Now it should work. If it's not in cor the correct position, unlock the omen window and position it. Now type recount GUI. Change the profile. The colors doesn't auto update. To update the colors, go to color the colors tab and check the title and background colors. Also update your font style. Now type XP bar none config. Go to profile. And change it to pixel point UI. This add-on does not auto-update as well, so you have to manually check the settings. Also be sure to don't change the individual numbers on the scaling. Just retype them and press enter to apply the scale. You can also copy and paste. Press enter. Now position the bar correctly at the bottom of the screen. Next, type Pitbull and click on Profiles and check Pixel Point UI. Next, type Quartz and change the profile. Same with Gladi UI. Go to Profiles and change the profile. Next, type Slash Grid Config change the profile. Now type slash aloft waterfall and change the profile. Next type sldt config. Now the text elements are draggable. Drag them to the bar. It doesn't need to be perfect. Right click on the elements. You can now change the displaying text to your liking. Also change the Y offset to 87 for, per for it to be perfectly aligned. Do this for all elements. To remove any object such as the clock, right click on the object and uncheck enable. Type sldt config to lock the text objects. You're now done. Enjoy the UI.